Okay. Hello, this is Zangrawaki based in California. Thank you for watching my video and supporting my channel. I'll introduce how to fish in the Japanese way using popular techniques in Japan and Japanese fishing gear. Look, look. This is G Crack Bellows Crow. G Crack is a Japanese lure maker based in Gifu Prefecture. It's in the Chubu region of Honshu. Gifu is a popular destination for tourists since there are World Heritage sites, Shirakawa Go and Tatayama, small traditional villages that look like from the hundreds of years ago. G Crack has produced many lures for both freshwater and saltwater. Bellows series can be the most popular among their products. All the body parts are covered by ribs. It's made of what they call SAF, soft material, which smells strongly. Salt, amino, and flavor. SAF, soft material. Because of the numerous ribs, this lure looks somewhat chubby. But it makes the body very soft touch. I believe when fish makes a bite, they will hold the lure for a long time, not easily spit out. Look at these curls. This should have a super sexy action in the current. Yeah, very unique lure. I rigged this on a Texas rig fished a saltwater jelly. Let's check out the fishing footage. Bellows Crow Bellows Crow It's a three Okay, go This bellows series has tons of leaves on the old parts. Not just the body. This bellows crow has leaves on the clouds. That would catch the water and should make phenomenal action for sure i believe and it also smells smells super strong come on looks promising if that's fish <laughs> If there's fish, she should not be able to stop making a bite on it. I hope so. Hmm. Could be better. It could be better to peg the weight, I suppose. Um, since the body is 
deep and has uh, tons of reefs uh, that catch the water. Meaning, Bell's Crow has a slower falling speed compared to other crow type bait in the same size. Then could be better to peg the weight. Make sure it go down to the bottom and always touch down the bottom. Or I would need to give it a longer pose. Make sure that the lure hits the bottom. Yes. Wow. Okay, Calico. <laughs> it was surprising. <laughs> Wow, I call it Calico. <laughs> good size. A good size Calico I call it, but it was a surprising bite. Yeah. When I reeling in, just to pick up, it made a bite. Chased after the lure and made a bite. Wow, <laughs> exciting. But Hmm, slow and tough, <laughs> slow and tough, no spotty, no sandbars. Hmm. Super tough. Oh, 
Okay, bird sunbass. Uh, nice size. G crack. Bellows crab. Extra three. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, Bellows Crow, Texas Week. I caught two fish, bird sand bass and charico. Both were good size. Oh, this smells. This smells. Be careful, you put this in your bag. Then your bag would smell bad. I'm pretty sure this smell attracts fish, but no, 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 no. <laughs> anyway, it was a good day. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please make sure like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you. Bye bye.